You've had brandy by the fireplace, but how about brandy on the beach? Let's get tasting. Today on tastings.com, we have a couple of fun new tropical brandies from the Philippines. They are the Imperador Solera brandy and the Imperador light brandy. These are very interesting brandies in that they are made with Spanish brandies that have been aged in a Solera system for many years. What's unique about the Solera system is that it's a pyramid shaped arrangement of barrels that has very old brandies in it and they take the oldest brandies from the very bottom of the Solera. So you have a nice mixture of old and young brandies. It's got a beautiful amber color, a wonderful tropical fruit kind of nose with a little bit of spice and cola. On the palate, lots of caramelized fruits, kind of like pie fruits. There's still that spice there. There's that nice brandy kind of warmth to it. It's really delicious and a nice long finish. And they also have a light version called Imperador Light. So this is a lower alcohol version. It's very popular in the Philippines. They use it neat and in cocktails. We have a couple of different cocktail recommendations for you today for each one. First, for the Solera, we recommend a Solera and Coke. Very simple, easy to make cocktail, just Coca-Cola and the Solera brandy. For the Imperador Light, we have what we call a brand tea, which is Imperador Light Brandy and Tea sweet tea in this case. That's how they drink it in the islands. Just a very simple, fun tropical cocktail you can enjoy at the beach. These are both very interesting new brandies, brand new to the US market. They are very flexible and versatile. They kind of work like a rum, so you can think lighter and more flavorful and fun kind of cocktails, or you can sip them neat. They are the Imperador Solera and the Imperador Light. Cheers.